Okay, continuing on, let's say you go and get some text and like this and I paste it in and now it's funny looking. See how it doesn't match any, any of my other things here? So I, what I could do is I could um, paint over that formatting here, okay? So there's a little uh, trick you do. Okay, so this is how I'm gonna use the, the this little paint format button up here. You select whatever is kind of, you're kind of dipping your brush in. I want everything to look like this. Or this thing I want to look like this. Okay, so this funny looking text down here, I want it to look like this. So I've selected it and then I tap on the little roller paintbrush. So that's kind of loaded that formatting into that paintbrush. And then whatever I paint over is now going to inherit that. Okay, so it's like I painted that format. Really easy trick. And this one will really impress the parents. Okay, you'll be like, what? So anyhow, that's how to format that. Okay, I'm just going to clean up a couple things here. This is looking all good. I think for this thing here, I want this to start on a new page. So look at this little trick here. I'm going to insert, you see where I am? I'm right in front of the A of my first paragraph. I'm going to insert a page break. Break, page break. And that forces it to break to the next page below it. So now, um, especially if I zoom out, let me just zoom out so you can really see what this would look like as a page. So here's my, my opening page, my title page, and then we've got my second page here. And then we've got our third page with interesting facts going on to our fourth page here. So that's that's looking not bad at all. That's coming across as a really nice looking report. But yeah, that's how to use those two things.